Good evening. Here are some of the headlines to look forward to regarding tomorrow the 22nd of September 2023. This is tomorrow's news today. We begin with national news. Please forgive me. Shaibu begs Governor Obaseki. Election Tribunal upholds Enugu Governor's election. As regards tribunal judgment, our faith in the judiciary is unshaken, says NMPP. Court stops PDP from dissolving Rivers Esco. Tinubu to gutteries. Human rights advocacy is shielding criminals. 17,834 persons jostle for vacant 1,454 Eboy civil service jobs. Ogulomeka and six others are in DSS custody over Shagamu cult violence. Body of missing voice of Nigeria journalist has been found inside a soccerway pit in Zamfara. NSCDC nabs five suspects for illegal oil bunkering and vandalism in FCT. Missing university student Blessing Karami has been found dead in Abuja. More pregnant girls rescued from suspected child traffickers in the southeast. In business news, ARIC Air shareholders debunks Asset Management Corporation of Nigeria Amcon claim of 240 billion naira. CBN postpones September 2023 Monetary Policy Committee meeting. In tech news, X long form post records 3 billion views. Cisco to acquire Splunk in $28 billion mega deal. In entertainment news, Lagos police exhumes Mobad's remains for autopsy. Senator Abo, Tonto DK, and Iyabo Ojo visit family. In international news, nine persons have been killed by unknown assailants in northern Ghana. Son of deposed Gabon leader Bongo has been charged with treason and corruption. Lastly, in sport news, Lionel Messi to miss another game for Inter Miami after leaving Toronto March early. South Africa launches High Performance Swimming Academy in Pretoria. Argentina remains top of FIFA World Rankings after September international break. Get details of these news and more on our website at guardian.ng or pick up a copy of our newspaper from your closest newsstand. Don't forget to follow us at Guardian Nigeria on all our social media platforms. I'm Ifinaya Wachiku for Guardian TV.